Ferris was originally supposed to be played by John Cusack, who had previously starred in Hughes' films Sixteen Candles and The Breakfast Club. But after several auditions, Matthew Broderick was chosen instead. Similarly, the role of Cameron was offered to Emilio Estevez before ultimately going to Alan Ruck. Another fun fact is that Charlie Sheen's cameo as a drug addict in the police station was originally supposed to be a much smaller role, but Sheen's performance was so memorable, they expanded the role. It's hard to say what made Matthew Broderick's audition stand out, but it's been reported that Broderick brought a unique mix of charm, wit, and charisma to the role. Additionally, Broderick had already garnered critical acclaim for his work in other films, such as War Games, which likely helped him stand out.